Since the day when he first pulled on a Panathinaikos Athens jersey, Dimitris Diamantidis has been writing a new definition of what makes a basketball superstar. Still wearing Panathinaikos green, Diamantidis this week received recognition for his one-of-a-kind career when he was celebrated as an official EuroLeague basketball legend in front of a standing room only crowd of his devoted home fans. My goal is to, when I came here to try to play and I try to, to improve that I can play in this level. So I was trying to play nothing else. I'm not thinking something else or to be a leader or to be a captain. I just wanted to play. I wanted to play to see how is this a big level to play against the best players. Twelve years later, his three EuroLeague titles, two Final Four MVP honours, four All-EuroLeague First Team nominations and six Best Defender awards make Diamantidis the EuroLeague's biggest collector of team and individual trophies this century. He didn't need to score much in order to achieve such success. He just did everything else that a player can do on a basketball court to make his team win. I play basketball, I try to help my team. Okay, if uh, you have one skill and this skill is good that you and help the team, for me it's good. I try to help the team with uh, my way. The Diamantidis way has been to excel at more different aspects of the game than almost any player. He is the EuroLeague's career leader in assists, steals and overall performance index rating. He also ranks second in games played, sixth in scoring and three-pointers, 11th in rebounds and 14th in block shots. Okay, if I can play defense, I will. If I can score, I will. If I can uh, give an assist, I will. If I try to steal the ball, I will. So I'm not thinking something like that, do something special. I'm just trying to play and the, the game Give me what uh, I can do or what I cannot do. His way led to the pinnacle of success for the first time that he and Panathinaikos became EuroLeague champions and Diamantidis was voted Final Four MVP in 2007 before another memorable Athens home crowd on his 27th birthday. It was uh, one important... Uh... One important moment in my career because it was my first uh, EuroLeague title and it was in Athens here in front of uh, all of uh, the fans of Panathinaikos who had a, a great season. He and the Greens again lifted the EuroLeague trophy in 2009 and for a third time together two years later as Diamantidis was voted both the full season and final four MVP. For me it's a great pleasure because uh, all those years in this team I have uh, most of them, uh, the times was good times for me. I had a great, 12, this is my 12th year in the team, I had great success uh, with the team, I enjoy all those years, uh, all the moments. Before the current season started, Diamantidis announced that he will retire when it's over because he wants to finish his career strong. I want to, to stop and I want to stop, you know, a little bit like uh, to be good on the court. I mean, not to be <laughs> lazy and uh, I cannot move and... I want to stay and to be on good, uh, good level. So I want to be, this is my last year, and I want to finish good. Once again, Diamantidis has led Panathinaikos to the playoffs. Now, a return to the Final Four after three seasons away remains the ultimate goal for the Greens and their leader. Who of the, of the players uh, don't want to go on a Final Four? I would like to be there, but you know it's very difficult to, to go. We'll try our best. 
His best has been more than good enough throughout an incomparable career. And now that Dimitris Diamantidis has joined the lofty ranks of official EuroLeague legends, anything on top of that would make for a perfect ending. I'm pretty satisfied until now. I didn't, I didn't expect this in my career, that I have this career until now. So I'm very, I'm very happy.